I may look like the perfect soldier, but I promise you, I'm Canadian. He'd kill you with apologies. Um, Tic Tac? Squigs, blonde hair, blue eye, don't let it fool you. What did you think of this one? We're doing Red Tails. Well, it's, it's not... You're already starting on with the... It's the, based... You're trying well, to give it excuses. No, no, it's, it's based on history, yeah, let's right? Get, let's go story. The real Tusk... Tusky... Is that how you say it? Tus Tuskegee. 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 The Tuskegee yeah, Airmen. Yeah, high five, we got it. Tuskegee yeah. Airmen. And that's the word of the day. Yeah, go ahead. T-U-S-K. A Gigi. A Gigi. <laughs> <laughs> we can't say it right. We sure as heck can't spell it right. We can, Canadians can spell, okay? Just so everyone knows. <laughs> yeah, we spell color right. That's right. Okay, so the story is based on this squadron of... African Americans. Yeah. African American... Uh, fighter pilots who they get the short end of the stick, right? Well, that's they, the idea. The, yeah, because put they figure because war. yeah. So these are guys. You know, I'm surprised that back in the day, there was you know that not enough white people, and that sounds horrible. You know, dropped this hate enough to actually give them planes, right? There's a people that fought for these tusk tusky gigi, igi, <laughs> and then they got these jets, and they ended up. Playing an important role. Tuskegee, Tuskegee. Yeah. Aren't you gonna like keep saying? Yeah, Tuskegee. they Tuskegee uh, Airmen. They they were like, you know, this is our country too. We're gonna fight for. It. And at, originally, the story goes, they were put as far away as they could from the front line. So they got to blow up a Nazi train every once in a while. Yeah, but it was nothing. Supply like, ship. Yeah, uh, it was not a mailman. Like, they scientifically thought it was yeah. an inferior. We were, we were stupid. We were really stupid back then. Yeah, but, but that's I mean, what I'm trying to say. So this is the first time in a war the Western world that the African Americans were given something to really push them forward, you know, what flying leaps. No well, they intended. knew they were they knew they were good. And the nice thing about this too is Pearl Harbor is another movie where you you focus on Cuba Ju Cuba, Cuba, Cuba Gooding Jr., Jr. who's also who's in also this movie, movie. Yeah. as you know the important part that these people played and the heroes that they are. So from now on, instead of saying Tuskegee, I'm going to say aluminum. Aluminum? Because some people can't say aluminum, <laughs> and I can't. <laughs> but the one thing that wasn't going for it, which I thought wasn't going for it, was a lot of the acting. Well, that's true, but you, you only really have a couple main actors in this, and they're not part of your main cast. Yeah. Terrence, Terrence Howard and Cuba Gooding Jr. These other guys, you have, uh, you know, a singer. <laughs> Neil. Neil, right? Yeah, and that's yeah, the whole yeah. thing, you know, you, I want... I want to see actors who are, are quality actors and... Or up-and-coming quality actors. No, but the fact is... None of these need, singers, none of the This Friana movie could have been so much more powerful stuff. if you would have had... You know, maybe you're trying to get... Put Neo in there, you try to yeah. get people in the seats, but the fact is, yeah. I think there's a lot I, of I other African-American actors out there who are amazing that could have filled this role. And that's the thing, right? I mean, if you are going to do a story like this, get your most powerful actors. Yeah, it's a strong make story. It, yeah, make... You know, make it something so memorable, right? A lot of people loved Pearl Harbor when it came out because of, you know, it's a powerful story. Pearl it Harbor, had a powerful you know, message. And that's what the thing is, is this, yeah, and this could have been so much better, right? But I came out of it. As far as everything else, I thought it was good, but the acting part came me out wanting. So we're kind of talking about actors right now. So I just want to mention that there's a lot of them in this movie. There's quite a few characters. I think there's almost too many because you can't feel for any of them, you know what I mean? Like you don't yeah. feel a backstory and you don't feel drawn by any of their specific characters throughout the movie. Yeah, you get tidbits. And like you said, there's no acting. You know, I want a picture so. of who they are, but you get only a snapshot. The flying ace, you kind of get his, yeah. his picture. And that'll just be pretty much halfway through the movie becomes his movie because the rest of them you realize that they can't act for one thing and there's, there's no worth in putting it back. The other big thing for me that was disappointing as far as storyline goes is very anticlimactic. It's because there's so many different mini missions. Like, I mean, the first one yeah. was important because it sets up the idea, but you have, like, I'd say half a dozen missions in this movie. And that's where I think I'm lost because there's no, like, build up to a big story. I still think it was an important story to share. I think it's, it's important to the war effort and to the contributions of I think these we're both looking forward people. to a reboot of this. For a story, I think that actually I feel is really dirty, gritty. Uh, like the, the Afro American people had to really fight for what's given for them. I felt this movie was really lighthearted, like a, a gloss over of the real, you know, the real dirt that they had to go through in order to really get this far in life. Yeah, I mean, war is not pretty, and 
you know, bigotry and all that's not pretty either. It doesn't do the Red Tails justice that way. No. So what are you going to give this one? I don't think it's going to be pretty. For me, it only gets a two and a half. Giving it a one. So this one gets a 3.5 out of 10 red noses. On to the next review.